Effective Tips for Handling Toddler Tantrums Tantrums are a natural part of toddler development, but for parents, they can be incredibly challenging to handle. While these emotional outbursts may feel overwhelming, it's important to understand that they are a normal way for toddlers to express their frustration or needs, especially when they cannot yet fully communicate their feelings. Fortunately, there are ways to manage and reduce the frequency of these meltdowns. Here are some effective tips for handling toddler tantrums. 1. Stay calm and patient. When a toddler throws a tantrum, it's easy for parents to become frustrated or angry. However, it's crucial to stay calm and composed. Yelling or reacting with frustration only escalates the situation. Your child looks to you for cues on how to handle emotions, and by remaining calm, you model healthy emotional regulation. Take a deep breath and remind yourself that tantrums are temporary and part of their learning process. 2. Acknowledge their feelings. Toddlers often feel misunderstood, which can lead to more intense tantrums. One of the best ways to diffuse a tantrum is to acknowledge their feelings. Saying something like, I see that you're really upset, can help them feel validated. Even though they may not have the vocabulary to fully express their emotions, knowing that you understand can help calm them down. 3. Keep routines consistent. Toddlers thrive on routine and predictability. When their daily routine is disrupted, it can lead to frustration and, in turn, tantrums. Maintaining a consistent schedule for meals, naps, and playtime helps toddlers feel secure and reduces the chances of outbursts. If there's going to be a change in their routine, try to prepare your child in advance to help them cope better with the transition. 4. Offer choices. Giving toddlers a sense of control over their environment can prevent tantrums from occurring in the first place. Simple choices like asking them to pick between two snacks or letting them choose their clothes for the day can make them feel empowered. This reduces frustration because they feel involved in the decision-making process. Just be sure to limit the number of choices to avoid overwhelming them. 5. Use distraction. Toddlers have short attention spans, which makes distraction a great tool for avoiding or ending tantrums. If you sense a meltdown brewing, try redirecting their focus to something else. For example, you can ask them about their favorite toy, start a game, or show them something interesting in the room. By shifting their attention, you can help them move past the emotional moment more quickly. 6. Set clear boundaries. Tantrums are often a way for toddlers to test limits. It's important to establish clear boundaries and stick to them. If you give in to tantrums or change the rules when they cry, it teaches them that throwing a fit gets them what they want. Be consistent in your responses and follow through on the rules you've set. However, it's equally important to be compassionate while enforcing boundaries. A calm and firm approach helps toddlers understand the limits without feeling punished. 7. Avoid triggers. Some tantrums can be avoided by identifying and managing triggers. Common triggers include hunger, tiredness, and overstimulation. If you know your toddler tends to have meltdowns when they're hungry, make sure to offer snacks before they get too cranky. Similarly, if they get overwhelmed in noisy or crowded places, try to limit the time spent in such environments. 8. Teach coping skills. While toddlers aren't yet capable of fully managing their emotions, you can start teaching them basic coping skills. Encourage deep breathing, counting to 10, or hugging a favorite stuffed animal when they're upset. Over time, they'll start to use these techniques on their own to calm down during emotional moments. 9. Be empathetic but firm. It's essential to strike a balance between empathy and firmness. Let your child know that while you understand their feelings, there are still limits to what they can do. For example, I know you're upset that you can't have more candy, but it's time for dinner. This approach validates their emotions while maintaining the boundary you've set. 10. Give them time and space. Sometimes, the best response to a tantrum is to give your toddler space. If they're in a safe environment, let them have a few moments to calm down on their own. Offering comfort after the storm has passed shows them that you're there for support without reinforcing negative behavior. 
Conclusion Handling toddler tantrums can be tough, but with patience and a few effective strategies, parents can manage these challenging moments with confidence. By staying calm, offering choices, maintaining routines, and setting clear boundaries, you can help your child navigate their emotions and reduce the frequency of tantrums. Remember that each tantrum is an opportunity to teach your child emotional regulation, which will serve them well as they grow.